This animation shows how osteoporosis makes bones weaker and more likely to break. Click the navigation arrows below the animation screen to play, pause, rewind or fast forward the animation. Your body is protected and supported by a framework of bone called your skeleton. Your bones are very strong. They have three main parts. Compact bone on the outside, spongy bone on the inside and bone marrow right at the centre. Your bones also have a nerve and blood supply. Here we show a cross section of bone to label the different parts. The structure of bone makes it very tough. A bone will only break if it's put under a lot of force or twisted awkwardly. Your bone is made of a strong mesh of proteins and minerals such as calcium. Here we've zoomed in to show the structure of the bone. Throughout your life, your bone is constantly being broken down and replaced. In early adulthood, mid-twenties to mid-thirties, your bones are at their strongest. This is because at this point your bone is being broken down and replaced at about the same rate. This is known as the peak bone mass. After your mid-thirties, your bone is broken down faster than it's replaced. So our bones gradually start to decrease in mass. As you age, your bone naturally becomes less dense and weaker. Women lose bone mass more quickly for some time after the menopause. Osteoporosis means porous bones. Bone with osteoporosis has a low mass because the mesh of proteins and minerals has been broken down. The bone becomes thin and weakened. Here we compare a bone with osteoporosis to a bone with normal mass for its age. You can see that the bone with osteoporosis is much thinner because the mesh of proteins and minerals has been broken down. This means it's more likely to break or fracture. People with osteoporosis have weaker bones that are more likely to fracture. Here we show the most common areas for fractures. These are the hip, spine and wrists.